welcome back. You are cooking with Sheila and Shamir and Theta. How you in, doing? In the Gangsta Goodies Kitchen, y'all. I'm so excited. I don't know what to do. I'm I'm like a kid in the candy store yeah, today. Like, mm -hmm. I am. <laughs> and so I want you guys to check this out real quick. The ingredients for today's episode include Crown Royal Apple, Schweppes, Ginger Ale, and the Pure Brand Cranberry Juice, and a good old fresh apple, y'all. Okay, so now, y'all, you talk about bringing R&B back. All of our young people ain't out there singing trash, okay? It's about love, it's about family, togetherness, the ups and the downs of relationships. Oh my God. So really, and I'm just going to say this, like uh, people my age and older, even my mama's age, like uh, Ashford and Simpson. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love it. So we're going to make a cocktail today. And so uh, we're going to, we call it the Forbidden Apple. Okay. Yes. And so whenever making a cocktail, you got your shaker filled with ice. Okay. And so we're going to use crown apple. Okay. And we're going to put uh, like two, two shots of crown apple. Mm, oh, it smells so yeah, good. It does smell good, doesn't it? And then we're going to put two shots of cranberry juice. It's really simple to make, y'all. See that? There's shot number one. And there's shot number two. Then we're going to shake it up. Shake, 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 shake. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> See, shake, 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 uh -huh. shake, shake, shake. <laughs> and then the last thing we do is we top it off with a little bit of ginger ale, okay? So we're going to get these drinks poured up, and then when we come back, we're going to sip and taste, and we're going to talk more to Shamir and Theta. We'll be right back, y'all. Okay, y'all, we are back. We've got the forbidden apple all shaken up, so let me pour y'all up some. All right. Okay? Mm -hmm. So here we go. And we say just a little room at the top for just a splash of ginger ale. Okay. It gives it kind of a little, little fizz. Mm -hmm. I love ginger ale too. Yes. Yes, she does. Okay. <laughs> 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 little fizz. Little fizz for you. Thank you. And then I'm going to pour me one. And then we're going to have a toast. And you guys tell me how you like the Forbidden Apple. Gotcha. Okay. You got your apple in there. Yes. Okay, y'all. Right. Cheers. 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 So success. Yes, absolutely. Cheers. To success. Mm. Ooh, this is good. Mm. A little bit too much. I like this. <laughs> mm. Simple ingredients. Yeah, this yeah, is coming to my next cocktail. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Just a little cranberry juice, a little crown apple. Hello. Crown apple. Top it off Where with you at? Where you at? Ale. Yes. That's good. <laughs> Top it off with ginger ale. Yes. Mm -hmm. I know, I like right? That. Okay. Yeah, this is good. Mm hmm. I probably added like a little ice in it, a few ice cubes. Yes. It was in the refrigerator. I tried to keep it cool, but yes, definitely, especially if you're serving it in a sharp ball glass, a little ice. I, mean, I just like ice in mine. Okay, there we go. <laughs> See, yeah. Like two, three cubes in there. So, mm, thank you guys like so much. So, they were here for a wedding. And yes, so yes, I'm like, please, right. please stop by the Gangster Goodies Kitchen so that we can tape an episode while you're here. And so I really, really appreciate you all making that sacrifice to stop by and, and do that. But I'm like, I, we have to share the story. And I always say that it's up to us to tell our story. Mm -hmm. Because if we don't tell our story, first of all, they, the other people, they're going to get it wrong. Mm -hmm. They're mm -hmm. going to tell it right. So it's up to us to tell our story, okay? And so can you tell people just a little bit about, uh, Victoria, where are you from? 
I'm from New Orleans. So oh, I'm y'all hear that twang in her voice? Mm-hmm. <laughs> She's a Southern girl. Oh, yeah. And Shamir, what about yourself? Kansas City, Missouri, right here at home. Uh-oh, home team, KC. Uh-oh, okay. So, okay, so how did you guys meet? Because you know people really want to know. They do. They really want to know. <laughs> it's literally just like we said on Instagram. We met, we wrote music, and we fell in love. Like, Aww. the first time we met, it was through a mutual a friend. He okay. produced beats. Okay. And, Shout out to um, LA. Yeah, he okay. basically contacted me. He was like, yeah, this guy, you want to get on a song with you? And then we wound up collabing. Oh, and then after person. that, <laughs> it was just like, oh, it was like, I want him popping. I love it. I love it. Ever since. So now, people would probably look at you all and think, okay, what kind of music do they produce together? Would never probably imagine that it's R and B. Yeah, R and B is kind of like we've heard that. It's kind of like R and B, hip hop, yes, new love trap, but not so humble. Keep it real. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. And we talk about real life experiences. Mm-hmm. Things dealing with family, things dealing with ups and downs. Every relationship is not perfect. Exactly. Right. So and I mean, who wants all. to promote a perfect relationship when we know that's just not true? It's not real. Exactly. It's and not And that's real. why people, a lot of people are discouraged from being in relationships because they see that, oh, they just, are oh, they too perfect. Oh, they think they all that. And yes. No. Yes. Things happen. We argue. Sometimes we can't stand each other. And then we other times we the are song. so in I love. Can't stand you. She can't oh, yeah. Stand you. And don't let us be mad. We're going to write a verse right off of that. I love oh, it. Oh, yeah. You want to, oh, yeah. Oh, I'm about to write something tonight. I love don't it. <laughs> but that's a really good way. First of all, it's therapeutic. Yes. It you very, get those feelings so. and thoughts yeah. out. Mm-hmm. And then you sing it to each other. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's amazing. It's been times like we'll be on stage and, and we sing it to each other. Even though we've performed it before or we're at home singing it regular. Yes. When we on stage, it's like a whole nother feeling. Mm-hmm. And like it's sometimes that we actually had, had tears in our eyes mm-hmm. and we rock really about to cry. Wow. Just from the lyrics of the song so, because everything we sing, we actually mean it. Yes. And it's, you know, it's actually real. So. Yes. You can tell. Um, at the wedding, you after everything was over and you guys were uh, ad libbing and oh, yeah. singing, and I think I got a little clip of that too. So y'all check that clip out. amazing is that so i really yes. know especially with virtual learning and oh, all yes. that too oh, yes it's like what it's probably all well, it's popping. so crazy because it's like the pandemic pushed me already in in a position where i already wanted to be in mm-hmm. yes uh before then i was already getting frustrated with the school system i had already taken them out and on and enrolled them for online classes okay then all of a sudden the next year they don't have to go to school everything's yeah, online anyway exactly. okay thank you wow like Yes. Work. So now that made it less costly for me to do it. Yes. Now it's not, it's going to be public school right at home. Exactly. Now I ain't got to worry about no fights at school. I don't have to worry about people yes. knocking on my yes. door, about no crazy yes. stuff. Yes. And I have to worry about um, teachers that are really not there to teach. Mm-hmm. Yes. And you know, yes. some teachers are really good. And, yes. and I can say out of all the teachers my kids had, they only had two really great teachers. Okay. All the rest of them, they just sit here and get a check. Wow. <laughs> you know? See, yeah. Yeah. You yeah. know, and that's not fair to the kids. They they want to learn. Yes, they, they do. Learn. And they're But they brilliant. can if it's so many other distractions in a way. Absolutely. Know? Absolutely. And so I want people to see, and like you said, this is real. This is real life. So no matter what stage you see them on, and you're going to continue to see them on major stages, life is real. Yes. And family and all of that it takes to 
make that happen. Right. So now mm -hmm. you all write and produce your own music. Yes. Wow. Okay, okay, so y'all know I need some gangster music, right? Oh, yeah. For the intro, the outro, so then when people hear that beat, whatever that beat is, because see, you guys are the experts in that, not me. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, yeah. When they hear that beat, that no matter what age they are, I want them to bob their head and go, oh, shoot, the Gangster Goodies Kitchen Show is getting ready to come on. It's going to be on it popping. Mm -hmm. We got to see who's on next, okay? Right. Okay. So we're going to work that out. Y'all okay. y'all stay tuned for that. Right. <laughs> now tell people where they can listen to your music at. So right now you can listen to our music on YouTube. Okay. But or we also are going to renew for iTunes. Okay. But currently we, uh, we want to re-release. Yes. So we want to re-release, right yeah, because yes. the first time we didn't have good management, we didn't, well, no, yes. you know, we, yeah. we, we didn't but have a lot of But you learn things. Places, so, yeah. Exactly. That's a part of the journey. Def, and it definitely is a part of the journey because yes. you learn a lot of different things when yes. you're doing it on your own. Yes. And when you're working with other people, a lot of times they try to get over, you yes. know, so we yes. have to be like, um, we're going to back out of that. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> absolutely. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So you're going to do a re-release mm -hmm. and... You'll let us know when so yes, we can we'll share that. Sure. And course. oh my God, you guys, I'm telling you, the voices that are coming out of these two human beings is so grand, so Thank amazing. You. We appreciate you, it. Yes, <laughs> it is. And the the energy, you know, that's uh that's huge. I do this for you. yesterday at the wedding this is how the spirit works okay and so the that just popped in my head and that's why when i came over to you guys i said i don't know if you guys are working on a movie or what mm -hmm. but the first words that came to my mind was queen and slim mm -hmm. and i thought and then you shared what you guys have coming up the pike so that's like right. awesome yeah we're definitely it. thinking of we're definitely doing like a want to do like a recreation okay video or either just like a photo some of their covers that they had like Ashford and Simpson or even like Peaches and Herb yes you know just recreating the older couples because you don't see a lot of newer couples out so you want to you know bring that spirit back yes yes oh my god thank you so much I know you guys have other people to see and things to do while you're here in Kansas City. <laughs> Everybody's Thank you been blowing so up our phone right. like, uh, come here, come here, Thank come here. You. Yes, let's have another cheers. I'm sorry, I didn't. Yeah, look, yeah, I look, did look, look, here, look, look, good, look, 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 here, let's give you some more. Apples. There we yeah. go. Yeah, that's gone. Yeah, thank you. And you then like forbidden apples, you see. We'll put your social media <laughs> stuff where they can find you on Instagram, YouTube, and yes. all that. We'll put those links up Instagram, so people YouTube, know. And Facebook. We're definitely always active on Facebook always. and YouTube. I'm okay. And Instagram. And Instagram. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. YouTube, we got to um, upgrade. Yes. I'm working on that, too. <laughs> Look, it's a, when you're doing it all but, yourself, it's, oh, it's yeah. a lot. Exactly. But, you know, the journey, like you said, with the journey, we've met a whole bunch of different mm -hmm. people that are willing to put in the work. Yes. And, you know, Rent really put in the footwork. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, on our show where in Atlanta, we uh, did run into the mans on an airplane. Wow. It was like strange oh. numbers. I'm talking about like phone to phone. Like it was, wow. It was and emails. Asking right? us to write music for them. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. You all are an inspiration. You know, Thank you're you. an inspiration to uh, young people, to black love, to black family, and black music, soul music, you know, mm -hmm. real music, mm -hmm. you know, <laughs> real music. That's what we're to bring back. Yes, thank y'all so much. Well, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. And you are inspiration too. Aww. Mm. Thanks, goodies. Mm. Yes, cheers. Yes. Yes, you all enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you so much for watching. Mm -hmm.